And I'm like, daddy, that is great. And he installed in us a sense of work and that the man has to work and provide for his family. I'm like, thank you, dad, for telling me about that or installing this in me. But you know what, dad? I don't want to do what you do. Welcome back to the show, guys. If you're not part of this show, let me ask you. Listen to me. This is a favor, right? Subscribe to the channel right now. Guys, I need your help. I'm trying to get to the end of the month, a thousand subscribers. If you think you could give me an opportunity of a new content creator, hook it up. Let's get right into it. Jack Ma 996 model. Jack Ma came on the fire for saying that if you want to be part of Alibaba, Jack Ma, for the people that don't know, is the founder of Alibaba, owner of Alibaba, right? He said that if you want to work for his company, Alibaba, you better be prepared to do the 996 model. The 996 model is, is not the Porsche 996. That's a car for you car enthusiasts out there. But it's not that. Is you better be work. You are you should be able to work. If you want to work for him from 9 in the morning to 9 at night, six days a week. Modern slavery, in my opinion. How much money does this man need? Or what is it that he needs all this money for at the cost of workers right this is the, these are my thoughts that i have been dragging almost since i've been around 21 years old regarding work i my father has been a laborer all his life a hard working man thanks to him and god obviously god first he we, we have been able to enjoy a life of no n not not being hungry i don't know what it is to be hungry I've always had a, a gallon of milk in my in my uh, refrigerator, food, rice, whatever it is. We 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 not rich. We always had a roof over our heads, but we we don't know what it is to be hungry. Thanks to God, right? He has been a hard working man. My dad has never had weekends off. He has days during the week, but always working, always working overtime. And 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 I grew up seeing that, and I'm like daddy that is great and he installed in us a sense of work and that the man has to work and provide for his family i'm like thank you dad for telling me about that or installing this in me but you know what dad i don't want to do what you do i i didn't tell him i wasn't talking to him i was just making it up right i i don't not want to be what my dad is right so in when i was around 21 i ended up going i'm from the dominican republic i was born there i came here when i was six years old and I see the way society is structured, society being structured in a way, and society tells you indirectly who you have to be and what you have to be when you grow up and how you have to be, right? And I and, and I saw this and I'm like, wow, these people are just working and then out of nowhere, you know, they die and they're, they're, they're not living life, enjoy this wonderful earth that God put us here to live. And I'm like, I don't, I don't want to live like that. I do not want to live like that. I don't want to be 60, 65 or whatever, 80, 90 years old and in my deathbed and, 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 and saying, wow, what did I do with my life? And I see that that's where a lot of people are headed. They're always broke, never have any any type of money, and doing the same exact thing, this this monotony of this nine, and I'm complaining about the nine to five. Jack Ma is saying nine to nine, right? This nine to five, Monday through Friday, every single day, basically, two days off, slavery, modern slavery, there's no other way, right? Comments like this, by the way, from Jack Ma is, is it that have a lot of poor people um, turned against the rich people because, like, Dude, how much do you want, right? So anyway, when I was around 21, I decided to go back to the Dominican Republic. I'm like, I'm tired of what, what I see here in the United States. I'm tired, and I want to go check out a different lifestyle. I was going to, go, quote, unquote, supposedly get a job over there and all these things. I had a little bit of money from my income taxes that I had um, uh, acquired. And I'm like, I'm going to go out there. I'm going to live out there. And, you know, I'm a, I'm a, you know I, have, I haven't, I had not even gone back from the Dominican Republic on uh, uh since I was six years old, again, because my dad, we have a big family. My dad wasn't able to buy tickets for everybody. Anyway, I'm in Dominican Republic, um, and I left over there. To make a long story short, I ended up coming back. I didn't even look for a job. I did end up finding, you know who? My wife, right? But anyway, from when I'm 21 years old, I end up going to the Dominican Republic saying that I don't want this life. I, don't, I, don't, I, I want to enjoy my life and do something with it that I, I, fi I find myself, you know, that I have, that I find pride and joy in doing, and that I have the time to do 
whatever I want with my time. Um, I have gone through different stages of my life by saying, what is it that you need in life? Talking to my brother the other day, I find out that he has even changed. My brother is a, a big uh, entrepreneurial guy. And he has the entrepreneurial, uh, the entrepreneurial mindset, just like me. Obviously, one of the reasons that I started this channel is to help me get there, wherever it, where is it, wherever is it that I wanted to go. And I'm telling him, and, and, and it surprised me a little bit that he told me, bro, I just want enough. How much is enough? That's a question that you got to ask yourself. How much is enough? What 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 is it that you want to do with with your with, with your life? What are the resources that you need to be able to give you? And this is the big thing that a lot of people are, are looking. I don't know if necessarily they're looking for that Lamborghini or that mansion, which is understandable. Uh, I was one of those, right? But people, the major, the, the main thing that people want to do, probably I might be wrong. They want to have free time they want to be able to do with their time as they please they just want that freedom to do whatever is it that they want throughout uh throughout the years or whatever it is right i have been i have decided that i i just need what wh what are my needs and what are my wants and i have i have a clear path as to what i need i don't need a lot of money i just want to be able to have the time to spend it with uh, doing the things that I want and the interest that I that I that I enjoy doing like for example I love to do these videos I love to do them I love to get on this mic I love to research my ideas I love to write down my ideas down I want I I, I, I love to talk to people I love to engage with people I want because the job is a necessity in that, but that's not the only thing that makes humans think. We are super, super complex individuals. Society is super complex, and there's a lot of things that make the culture as a general tick. And that's from work, super important. But again, there's also the arts. There's also um, a whole bunch of things that make society think, and life is wonderful. And Jack Ma, you're wrong. You are wrong. You're straight up wrong. Like, why do you, I mean, how much money does this man have? I think he's a billionaire. If not, whoever knows what it is, let me know. I think he's a billionaire. If he's a billionaire, how much money do you want? Are you going to fall into the trap of, okay, now you have a million, now you want two million. Or now you have free time, now you want to keep going and keep going and getting more money. Once I'm able to do whatever it is that I want with my time, whatever comes after that is extra. There's a huge movement from millennials. Excuse me, guys, if you guys heard that noise, but guys, I'm I'm in my I'm a, I'm in my 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 sala right now. I'm in my living room, right? You guys want me to get a studio? Start subscribing. You heard? <laughs> if you haven't subscribed, man, I, I need your help, guys. I need to get to a thousand subscribers before that another month. I, that's a personal challenge. But anyway, let me get back to this. You got to decide what is it that you want with your life. How much is enough for you, your specific need? I have gone through so many uh, things in my life in mentally as to what what is it that I need. There's huge movements of what is it of minimalist, right? Minimalism. What, what do you need to live? Do you really need that nine to five? Um, for, for 25 years of, the, of your life to be able to have a, a joyful life in this world? Do you need that nine to nine? Six days a week. Do you need that? Find out. Guys, God bless. God speed me, Valentine. I'm out. Really? You made it to the end of the video? Congratulations. You have no life. Go check out one of my other videos. Sub to the channel. Give me a like. Give me a comment. Check out my other social media, which is Twitter, Instagram, and Facebook. I do have a life, so I'm not going to be that active. But follow me on there. God bless. God speed me, Valentine. I'm out.